Alright, this will probably be the only time on my channel you'll ever see me review a movie like this. It's, this is where the dead go to die. Alright, so I came across this movie October, uh, the day be uh, the night before Halloween. Uh, we were at, I was at my friend's house and we were looking up random shit and we came across this movie. Uh, he put it on because he heard of how fucked up it was and uh, we we watched it late at night. He fell asleep um, and I watched and I continued it because I wasn't tired and then he pa then he paused it then I woke up uh, the next morning. Yeah, yeah, and then I woke up the next morning, and he put it on for me, and, uh, I didn't really get that far, actually, when, uh, we didn't even really get too, too far, uh, the first night, but then the sec, then when I woke up in the morning, we, we still didn't get that far, I, I got a headache, we, we watched it on YouTube, the, whoever uploaded it to YouTube had a very shitty quality of this movie, and, uh, kind of hurt my my brain a little bit i was getting a headache as i was watching it and this movie's awful by the way like look this movie's so terrible not even blu-ray uh, bothered to put blu-ray right in here that's how awful this movie is um this movie is just god awful like nothing's good about this There's like nothing good about this movie whatsoever um basically a dog takes these three children to like uh, different places of hell or something like that, and this one girl gets abused by her father, and who, who also owns like a a child porn tape trading ring, and uh, another kid named Tommy who who's uh who meets this dog. Well, actually, the, he, Labby meets Tommy first, and basically Labby thinks that uh. Tommy's little brother, who's not born yet, is the uh, second coming of the devil or something like that. And so he, he he has to rip the devil fetus outside of the mother's vagina. And uh, this is an animated movie, and this movie is fucked up beyond recognition. Everything about this movie is fucked up. There's like so many weird, strange sexual almost imagery in this movie it's like how did they come up with this movie they had to have been high while making this um the animation for this movie is beyond cheap it's the same kind of animation technique that they used for uh food fight but at least food fight had actors that we know no one in this movie nobody we is in this movie that i know at least food fight had like charlie sheen hillary uh hillary duff i almost said swank uh wayne brady and uh Maybe Tim Curry. This one, this movie has no one. Not even. No, it has no one. I'm not sure if you guys know who Brandon Siegel is. Ruby La Roca, uh, uh, Joe Smacky, Victor Bronicor. You guys don't know this. I don't know this. I don't think anybody knows this besides the director and the people who worked on the films themselves. But this movie is just garbage. It's absolute garbage. My f the friend who I saw this with bought this for me on Amazon as a joke, and you know I'm keeping it. It's a uh, why the hell not? I'm not gonna watch it again. I bought for his birthday, which is a couple, which is about a about a week or two ago. No, two and a half weeks ago, uh, we watched this at his house. Me, him, and a group of our friends watched this at our house, and we all hated it. This movie is literally probably one of the worst movies I've ever seen. This is. One of the worst movies next to Mr. Popper's Penguins in Jaws the Revenge. That is how awful this movie is. I give this movie... Even Zero Stars is too generous for this movie. I don't even know what to give this movie. Negative 2,000,529,80 billion stars. Negative. Yeah. It, it deserves negative, neg negative amount of stars. That is how awful this movie is. Don't waste your time. Do not waste 95 minutes. Now waste $20 like my friend did on this movie. Don't, don't.